So this is my first time bike packing. So we started off from Nettishall Heath Nature Reserve in Suffolk and went to Cove Hive on the Suffolk coast, which was around about 45 miles. Here is my bike packing set up. It's made mainly of cheap bags, but they're actually pretty good quality. Um, I'll put links to them on Amazon if anybody's interested down below. Uh, also, I will do a more in-depth video on the bike packing bags in the future. Unfortunately, I didn't get too much footage on the way because I got lost a couple of times. I blame the satellite navigation, so... We stopped about 30 miles in, got something to eat and had a quick rest and then we went back on our merry way. You are close to your destination. Yeah, so we got here in the end. Uh, it's a bit of a breeze, but it was quite a warm breeze because it was really hot this day. It was like 27 degrees Celsius or something. So, really nice. Bike made it. All the bags stayed in place. Didn't have anything moving around or anything. So that was really good. So the bags work really well. So we took a walk around and explored the area. Uh, because of the COVID situation, um, there's not many pictures at campsites at this present time. Uh, so we had to do a bit of wild camping. Uh, we pitched um, in the corner of a field uh, where you know it was off the track, nobody could see us, nobody could hear us. And uh, yeah, it was really nice, uh, really great sunset in the morning here. Yeah, it was absolutely beautiful, six o'clock in the morning, woken up by the birds, lovely. Didn't have too bad a night's sleep actually, gotta say. Uh, here we're just um, packing up, ready to go, collecting all rubbish or anything so we don't leave anything behind. But yeah, it's a really beautiful morning. So we made our way back, it was probably about 7 o'clock time because my brother had got to be back for an appointment.
So the bags worked really well, they didn't bob about or move about too much. Um, really impressed with them actually. I will make a video in the future on the bike packing setup. On the way back we went through some nice little villages um, and some really nice windy country roads and that. Uh, really nice, I haven't been through a lot of these um, small villages in the past so it was really quite nice to go through. In 170 metres go straight and continue on Skull Road, then turn left. Follow this way for 3.8 kilometres. The one of the bits that I didn't film uh, was we was going along, it's going quite fast, and we see a dead badger on the side of the road, unfortunately. Uh, it's a shame because it's the first one I've actually seen in the wild. So nearly home now, I've uh, got to say I really actually enjoyed myself. So this is the end, I uh, hope you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up if you did, please comment down below and subscribe, it would be much appreciated. I uh, will put links to the bags down below. Uh, yeah, thanks very much, see you next time, bye.